Wow. After fermenting 2.5 gallons of rice water for a week, the time has come. <laughs> Today we're gonna begin the 7 day rice water challenge so please make sure to check the description of this video to learn how to make this Yao rice water recipe. Don't forget to share some love to this girl by liking this video and let me show you the Yao rice water routine that we're gonna follow this entire challenge. Hey guys, it is day one of using rice water on my hair for seven days. So we're gonna start off this routine by detangling our hair as similar as the Yao women do, which is with our hair upside down, starting from the ends to all the way to the roots using a wooden comb. However, if you don't have a wooden comb like me, a white tooth comb is acceptable. Right after I detangle my hair, I am going to apply my rice water. Just like the Yao women do, we're gonna rinse our hair with rice water inside of a large bowl. You gotta mix it. Now you're gonna place your hair inside the bowl and begin the washing process as the Yao women do, which is basically soaking your hair and scalp in rice water. By the way, don't forget to massage your scalp while rinsing. After this, you're gonna drink some water out of your hair using your hands Next step is wrapping your hair around your head like this. Now you're gonna use your comb in this way to secure the hair wrap in place. Um, remember. Remember, Yao women leave the rice water to soak in their hair for 20 minutes. So that is exactly what we're gonna follow as well. When time is up, you're gonna rinse the rice water out of your hair in the river. Talking about the river. So I asked the police and they say no. By the way, the police, my husband. So, no. I cannot wash my hair in the Delaware River. The alternative way for this step will be rinsing the rice water out of your hair with distilled or filter water during this challenge. So every day I'm gonna wash my hair with eight cups of distilled water. Let's not forget that Yao women do not use shampoo or conditioner during the rice water ritual. So, so sorry amigos, we're not using those either. Once you are done, towel dry your hair a little bit and as the final step, allow your hair to air dry completely just like these women do. Now that my hair is wrapped, I'm gonna use my white tooth comb to keep the hairstyle in place. Looks good, right? And here's how my hair looks on day one. By the way, I am not storing my rice water batches in the refrigerator. This is where I keep all my rice waters. Hey guys, we are on day two. The first thing that I noticed is how soft my hair is. Excellent. Girl, it's just farting. I have some shine on my hair. Instead of having some volume, my hair does feel super flat. <laughs> flat. So far, the experience of using the rice water is quite nice, so I cannot complain. What do you think about this hairstyle? Looks good, right? I don't know if it looks good, but it's fine. <laughs> it's been 20 minutes now, just the right time for my tooth comb to fall. Let's just wait for that to happen. I knew it. My hair is completely cleaned, or that's what I like to think. <laughs> And that'll be it for day two. See ya later, alligator. I don't know. <laughs> what a beautiful day to wash my hair in the river. Hey guys, I have a new update from the rice water. <laughs> it looked like a scary movie. I'm just absolutely speechless how my hair looks at this moment. So I noticed throughout these days that my hair is so manageable. When I brush it, I really don't need to untangle my hair that much. When I wash the rice water with water, the next day my hair doesn't have any smell. Like, not even citric smell or rice water smell. No smell at all. As soon as my hair dries, it becomes so soft. It's crazy, ridiculous soft. So, we're good so far. And this is how clear the water is at the end of my water rinse. 
I am around the house all the time and this is the hairstyle my husband is seeing every single day and I keep saying him, do you like it? Wow. Uh, excuse me, can you explain to me where all this hair is coming from? I feel like I'm wearing a wig right now. Crazy! This does not feel like my regular hair feels like. And it looks so shiny. Feels like rice water has doubled the amount of hair that I had when I started. This little piece of hair right now feels like my ponytail from last week. <laughs> Ooh. My experience so far applying rice water on my hair has been sick. I'm obsessed with this. I never thought that anything in this world will be able to hold my hair in one place. I'm thinking maybe I should stop shampooing and just use rice water because it is doing a fantastic job in cleaning my scalp. Look at that. My hair at this point has significant improved in appearance. I am... By the way, this is the third gallon of distilled water that I'm using. Oh yeah, I spent money on this. I wish I was in Costa Rica. I would have nailed this washing my hair in the river. You guys would have seen it. The smell does smell a little bit like puke. I don't know, after using onions and after using so many stuff on my hair, fermented rice water does not scare me. No pain, no gain. Yeah. So far, my hair has been accepted the rice water pretty, pretty well. I noticed at this point that my hair looks so dark. Comment down below if you think that my hair looks darker. The Yao women, they actually apply rice water as well to prevent gray hair. Even the grandmothers, they have super, super dark hair. Darker than my hair and then your hair. I will see you guys in 50 minutes so that I can rinse this off and be done for day six. The time has come. <laughs> if you are looking for that kind of natural way to thick your hair because you have fine thin hair, rice water is the way to go 100%. My hair looks absolutely clean. I don't have any grease and no dandruff. But here is the thing. There's always a thing, yes. Today, I am actually pushing the limits of my hair taking protein at this point. The other parts of my hair look absolutely beautiful, except the ends, like I said. Look at this, it's like so stiff. Once your hair completely dries, I do not have any baby puke smell on my hair. Even though it smells pretty bad, mm-hmm. Your hair is not going to smell the next day. So as you know, I am going to wash my hair with shampoo. So I'm just going to follow my hair wash routine. This one right here. Please make sure to check it out. And I will share with you guys tomorrow my entire result. When I started this challenge on day one, I measured my hair to see if rice water can increase hair growth in only seven days. So on day one, my hair length was at 29 inches long. And by day seven, when we measure again, my hair length was at 30 inches long. In terms of my hair results from using rice water, just take a look at day one and day seven. Personally, I see a huge improvement in the texture of my hair. I do believe with all Oh my bunny heart that rice water can make your hair super shiny soft manageable and make thin hair become seriously thick unfortunately seven days of rice water is too much for any hair including mine because of the protein overload that you can develop to me three to four days is the perfect amount of rice water that you can apply on your hair once a month if you want to follow this challenge because those were the days where i noticed the best of the best results salt in my hair ever. Don't forget to share some love to this girl by subscribing to this channel if you haven't yet. I love you all. See you next time. Pura vida.